Now, one thing I want you to think about as I now go through these, what type of convincer are you? Or what type of convincer strategy do you run? Because you will be familiar with the four different types I'm about to run through. Okay, so the first is the automatic convincer. So that's the person who, once they've made their decision, are automatically convinced they believe in their decision and make the purchase straight away. We then have the number of times convincer. That's where I normally get some nods, because that's the type of person who actually, yeah, they've made, they've made a decision on what product or item that they want, but they would rather try out a number of items first. My wife's like that. Go shopping. Choose a pair of jeans, and then we spend all day going around all the shops in town, trying on all the pairs of jeans until we come back to buy the original ones that she's first looked at. But that's her convincing strategy. We then have the period of time convincing. That's the person who, perhaps, if my friend had then seen the car and said, I'll sleep on it. I'm not going to make the same joke and say that he's going to sleep on the car. <coughs> but actually, he'll need a period of time in which he makes his decision and he's convinced. And then we have the, the consistent convincer, and that's the person who constantly needs to be convinced that they've made the right decision. But once the convincer strategy has been run, the purchase is then, is then completed. It's only then that the reassurance strategy